Okay, guys. Bitcoin ETF came out. Bitcoin went back up to all-time high. Bitcoin just had a flash crash on the Binance. And just like a couple of minutes ago, it had another flash crash. This is the most volatile product out there in the world. And everybody wants a piece of Bitcoin. El Salvador just bought more Bitcoin for their people, which will probably make their people rich due to the hyperinflation of their money. Most of the countries in the world are moving to digital currencies. Everything is being changed. So let's talk about the Bitcoin ETF really quick. It wasn't a huge news to me because the first time futures, can, futures contracts came out from the CME, from Bitcoin, they wasn't holding Bitcoin. It was just cash. Cash trading. With the ProShares Bitcoin ETF futures, they're not holding any Bitcoin. It's just people betting on the price of Bitcoin. So that wasn't pretty big news to me. Once we get news of an ETF that physically holds Bitcoin, have to go out in the market and find Bitcoin to buy and put it in their holdings, I would be happy with that. But there are baby steps to take before we get to the main steps. Now, the price of Bitcoin, um, it popped from 30K. I thought it was going down to 20K, then popping back up. It's correlating directly to the stock market, the S&P 500 and the Dow Jones. As they move up higher, I believe we'll see Bitcoin move higher. Kathy Wood recently said that Bitcoin and stocks are not going down. And that is very hard to believe because we're having major problems with shipping, inflation, jobs. The world right now is having a huge major problem due to COVID. Once we see the Federal Reserve cut down on the interest rates, I believe we will see the price of Bitcoin move back down to 20K. But that may not happen until the beginning of next year. So we might see Bitcoin move up to 100K. I don't know. The one thing I do know, we have to go back down to touch 20K. We have to go back down to touch 20K. And that will be a cycle that usually takes two years to get out of. For me and you to accumulate everything out there, an another opportunity big opportunity so if you guys hoping Bitcoin continues to go up that's good I have no problem with that everybody has a little stash they hold on to but if you want to be mega rich you want large investors institutional investors to dump their Bitcoin and let you hold it and then they buy from you from a higher price let me know what you guys thinking, because the Bitcoin ETF really didn't mean anything. It was just for show to me. It's just news. If you think it was huge, leave a comment at the bottom. Let me know what you're thinking. And all you guys, hit the like button, hit the subscribe button. I give out great content. And all you guys have a good day. And all you guys have a good night. And enjoy the crypto life. Peace.